You know, I, I, no, I don't understand that. They have so. Damn. Okay, we lost the mirror beast. I can only have who gives a shit. I think it's already endangered. Why are you, Mr. Smarty Pants? Can I please ask why it isn't the scientist that would be Mr. Smarty Pants? Just asking. And the Pokemon we just saw see what <sighs> The Pokemon we see now on the right is Shedinja. It is the shell left over after a, uh, um, Nakata or something like that evolves. It's the, it's kind of the, it's kind of the friend of the, uh, Shedinja, the Pokemon that constantly has a speed burst boost every turn, and I think it is the fastest, uh, Pokemon ever. Yeah, it's probably when it evolves, it gets into the Shedinja. Its shell turns into Shedinja, which has one HP, literally. However, it has Wonder Guard, which means unless you do super effective damage against it, it won't hurt it. Therefore, we're actually going to have to set this up quite intelligently. Though, to be quite honest, Shed Ninja is not a powerful Pokemon, so we really should not have to worry about it. Um, I'm gonna be a bit... Uh, no, I don't know if that'll work. I think I'm just gonna use Body Slam. Still gonna try it, though. Well, but Fed has a lot of HP and learns both Counter and, um... Mirror Coat, meaning if he uses either of them on you when they do a lot of damage to him, he can pretty much fuck you over completely. See, he's not really doing that much damage. I'm not really too worried about him. God damn it, how do you know I'd use, I'd use that? See? See? It's fucking bullshit. You can't already tell, I kind of believe, uh... Wobbuffet to be a little fucking broken. I mean, in, in these games now, it's a little bit better, but still, come the fuck on. He does so much damage in one fucking go. Though, I don't think- I don't know if accuracy loss, uh, helps with that. Yeah, even a critical hit, that didn't- that didn't do shit, pal. I mean, notably, like, 30 damage, but still. Wow, it used Destin Bond. Oh wait, no. It didn't work. He's really trying to be an annoying fuck, isn't he? Um... Hopefully he doesn't use counter again. I don't know. Damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. If only I used a good move against him, I could kill him. Well then, more than likely, Gon's gonna be dead if Counter works against the Pokémon you want it to work against. It doesn't even do a fucking animation yet, it somehow sucks the life out of people. And this guy's just being a whore. D-D-D-Destin-Bond! 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 Yeah, Destin-Bond. Um... He's Iron Defense, and I'm gonna bring out... Cerberus, they'd be fucking shitting me. Oh, that's why he paired up Shed Ninja with Wobbuffet. Okay, I get it now. Um, actually, what I am going to do? Be smart about this bullshit. Just keep using Mud Love. Yeah, he might Destin Bond me, but he's just a Destin Bond faggot. Yeah, asshole. I'm trying to think, does Destin Bond work after, or before? Wouldn't that mean he has to use Destin Bond? I don't fucking know. Oh, whatever, I'll just go back and heal him. Besides, Zerberus needs some experience. And did he, either of us even get any EXP out of that? Yeah, fuck you too. This 
guy's just a war. Well, not, not really the Wobbuffet thing, just a war. Destin Mon's just a broken fucking move. Like, what would make it so much better if you couldn't use it in rapid succession? And I think the thing has like 10 PP too, what the fuck? Oh yeah, by the way, I have an Ice-type move, so, you know, times 4 damage to your Vibro, by the way. Yeah. And there goes all of his 1 HP. Fun fact, apparently they have like this creepy story about how if you look into the back of the Shed Ninja's, like the hole in the back of it, apparently it can suck your soul in. Ooh, and Shadow Pokemon. Magneton, Electric Steel type. Originally a uh, electric. Just a regular electric type until steel types were introduced in the uh, second generation. Fun fact. And fuck you. Ooh, excuse me. Alright, then now we just need this Pokemon to deal with. Uh, just use a bite on your ass. Being a steel type, it'll cover up some of its weaknesses. And I'm gonna switch out for say Bolt to do say to do say Beautiful paralyzations. I don't know. By the way, that was like a Russian type accent I was trying to pull off but failed. Actually no. Wait, what was I trying to do again? No, I think I actually was trying to Ooh, Shadow Rape. Ow, this is gonna hurt. Um I forgot what I was trying to do. I don't know. I always mix up my French and my Russian accent. Always do. Don't know why, it just happens. No, Thunder Wave. I put it right there for a reason, Michael. My first idea was to do the French accent, but I think I then I think I went to Ha Paralyzation or Flinch. Paralyzation. Fuck. Can't speak. Anyway, uh, mostly because, uh, I did a French accent not too long ago in the play I was in, which I've talked about how I didn't, I po postponed this Let's Play for the longest time because of that play mixed with school. I actually bought myself a Red Beret because of that, so, it's kind of cool. Like, I actually have it hanging in the side of my room. I kind of like it. It's a, neat, it's a neat decoration thing. I got a lot of unique hats, actually. I got, like, a, uh... Kind of like an Australian type of hat. And, he said, and I know I'm not talking about what he said, because he's just stupid. He is so out of place. What kind of a fucking nerd? Ooh, one system lever. No idea what that fucking does. Probably something downstairs, but I'm not sure. Anyway, I'm gonna go heal up. But anyway, I, I uh, the guy, the guy's so out of fucking place. He should be the scientist. Oh, thank God the Paris is, guys, guys, Paris is purified. Thank God we, we, we can, we now stand a chance against the Cyphers. Shelter, sweet. Shelter's cool. My god. Growlithe. Shit. God, maybe I should've just waited to purify the fuckers. Whatever, I shall purify those guys off screen. I think I might actually be able to turn all of those into another uh, thing. Possibly. Anyway, the types of hats I has. I has myself a very, uh... Kind of a, I think more of like a 70s, 90s kind of, 70 to 90s kind of golfing hat type of thing. Uh, also have kind of, I kind of have the skeleton hat too, which is pretty badass. I have, actually have another one that's a Pirates of the Caribbean skeleton hat. Got that while I was at Disneyland. And, uh, got a few other hats that really I just don't remember. <laughs> got a fedora. K kind of a, not, not like a really, really good fedora, but fedora nonetheless. Got it. Around the time my grandfather died, and it was kind of funny. Uh, me, we were, me and my parents were at the store, uh, and um, I just kind of looked at the hat and I put it on with these pair of glasses, and I looked like a spy. So I, I just thought it was really fucking funny. So I just kind of kept it. I, I bought it and kept it. Wait a second. He's a really big person. Is he that admin? No, he's just a big cipher. Okay, whatever. That makes sense. At least I think that's who he is. 
Correct me if I'm wrong, if that's not the same guy we fought back at, uh... At the, um, ONBS station. Then again, I might put it in the video itself, or in the description below. So, pick your choice. And actually, this is a fighting type which can beat both Avalanche and Gun. He has to go now. Or we can just fuck with him. By the way, rock types can also hurt Avalanche because of the ice thing. Or we can just fuck with him and do this. Because I don't think I can kill him this turn. Echo Seafall. And... Echo Seafall. That is my middle finger to you, my friend. Ooh, he's gonna start using rollout. Shit. Yeah, Water Pulse on you next turn. Yee, bulk up. Bulk up increases both attack and defense. Physical, that is. It is pretty much the physical version of uh, Calm Mind. Though you actually get uh, bulk up first in generation. Alright then, I think I'm gonna use Takedown on Macho and Water Pulse on Golem. Golem should go down with one hit because it's four times effective against water type moves. Yeah, sorry, rock ground types, as I've already explained, are shit. I know, I know there's some rock ground types which can be good, but majority of the time they suck. And he's dead. Couldn't deal with that shit. Come on. Fortress, uh, we've already talked about him, so I'm not gonna talk about it again. Oh god, seismic talk, that that always hits. Though because it always because it goes off of it's either you or the user's level and it does that much damage to you. Maybe at a certain point it's powerful, but at this point in the game, eh, no. Our levels are just too far off. I'm not really too worried about that, uh, for a trash, so I'm just gonna kill this guy now. Fortress just doesn't seem that powerful. To me, personally. Like, I thought about using a Fortress in this Let's Play. Yes, I thought about using a Fortress. Because I wanted the Levitate thing. And, um... Level 37, very nice. You're getting up there, Avalanche. But I, I just never really liked the idea of for, Fortress. I thought about it a few times, but really, when it comes down to it, its stats aren't great. Being four times weak to fire is kind of a problem, and really, I don't. I couldn't think of any. Real, I couldn't see any very powerful moves you could learn. So, not for me. But if you like using it, hey, that's cool. Really, Pokemon are fine how they are, like, it doesn't matter whether or not they're, like, incredibly powerful or just not that well against you. Uh, or should I say, in Pokemon, like I've said before, you really don't need to be that smart to use it. You could probably use whatever Pokemon you want and get through the game just fine. Notably, you might have to raise your levels a little bit higher for certain Pokemon, but hey. Because this game's pretty easy. Like, it's not the easiest game on the planet, and, like, and as you've seen, we've had some pretty tough battles before. Last game didn't have too many tough battles. Uh, this game is, has had some few tough battles, especially uh, with two of the admins we fought. Watch the AI hit Avalanche. Yep, he hit Avalanche, and he got a critical hit. Hmm, you know, damn, it's, it's only if he used it on Gone or something, like it would actually be good, especially with that critical hit. Seriously, that would have killed Gong, and I would have been pissed. I would have been, because he needs to get these level ups, which he's not getting. Hey, here's Crobat. Cool. Eh, sad of the Crobat looks ugly. Oh, come on. That's two Iron Tails you've missed. That one. Anyway, part flying type, Crobat goes down with ice type moves. You know, I wasn't actually looking at Avalanche, Avalanche's HP. Fuck, he might go down. Yeah, I think he might go down. Wow, he's still kicking. Keep going, Avalanche. Don't give up until your last breath. Bye-bye, Crobat.
Yes, you can hit two times, but you still get experience for some bullshit. Really? I keep forgetting for some fucking reason why uh, steel types are ineffective against water types for some bullshit unexplained reason, which I can never seem to find out why. Anyway, Avalanche, I want you to survive, so, like, send out Zerberus. Just goes. He gives me XP, too. I'm here! Where's the action? Wait, that's a Mantine. Why is that a Mantine? Oh my god, he's using Bubble. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh my god. Why did you bring me out? You fucking idiot! God, this guy's getting critical hits quite often. Oh! Dude! Why did you bring me out here? He's a fucking water type. What's wrong with you? Gone, you amaze me sometimes. Take down. See, let's see, watch. Bite! Bite! Fight! See, that's how you hit. No, but that didn't do that much damage. Ha! See, flinch. See, that works. And now you're dead. Life's better now. Yay! Genocide for everyone! Ha ha ha, good joke. And he just disappeared, good for him, I guess. Another fucking eye promotion. There. Alright, then search around this place, see if we can find anything special. Though I wouldn't be surprised if someone fell from the ceiling. Look, he's just like, yep. Get there. Nope, see, no problem here. We're an evil organization that, uh... We're an evil organization who masters in attacking, uh... People, I don't know. Doors locked from the inside. I'm guessing we have to put the lever over there? S excuse me, sir, can I get by, sir? Oh wow, I didn't even push the A button, he talked to me, okay. So I guess he's not completely stupid. <laughs> 